Assalamu alaikum. Hope you are doing fine. In this video, we will differentiate switch off the current rule and the voltage rule. We know switch off the current rule is used to find the current in a complex circuit. And uh, it uh, says that sum of current meeting at a junction is uh, zero. So it uh, supports the law of conservation of a charges. Why does it uh, support law of conservation of charge? Let me tell you. We know the current I is nothing but the rate of flow of charges. And according to the definition of Kirchhoff's current rule, sum of current, current is written written I, here is yes, capital letter sigma stands for summation or addition. Sum of current meeting at a junction is taken as a zero. And the current depends on the charge. If there is no accumulator present in a circuit, then the number of charges flowing in the circuit remains a constant. So in that way, we can say that it supports the law of conservation of charges. The next thing, Kirchhoff's current rule is applied for it is applied for closed and open circuit. It is particularly used to find the current meeting at a junction. It doesn't matter whether the circuit is closed or open. Whereas, when you talk about the Kirchhoff's voltage rule, it is particularly applied to a closed circuit. So, I will discuss Kirchhoff's voltage rule one by one. First thing, it uh, supports it uh, supports the uh, law of conservation of conservation of energy. Why is it so? Let me tell you. Uh, if, I, if I give the definition of uh, Kirchhoff's voltage, you may know that. Kirchhoff's voltage rule says that sum of product of current and resistance in each part of a circuit, each part of a closed circuit is equal to the total EM in that closed circuit. So in this way, the energy the flow in the closed circuit remains same, do not change. So, it uh, supports the law of conservation of energy. And the uh, third difference we find here is it is applicable, it is applied to a closed circuit. We do not apply Kirchhoff's voltage rule to an open circuit. I hope uh, this video is useful. If you have any kind of doubt related to the topic, kindly put your questions in the comment section. Thanks for watching.